if you are having problem with uh, connecting to your work VPN, if you work from home and you know I just install uh, Aries surfboard um, model sorry about the darkness it BG SBG 6580 and I guess yesterday while I was playing with my uh, modem configuration uh, I did something I guess that prevented me to you know from connecting to my work VPN all afternoon and I couldn't figure out what happened until today uh, I was checking first you go to your administration uh, there's uh, you can look at my previous video on how to get here but basically uh, you go you on the top you click on firewall and you know what I had my firewall set to low I guess I was playing with medium and low and I you know I, I left them there so as a result I cannot connect to my VPN at work and I could figure I could not figure out why so just a few minutes ago I set it to off and apply make the changes and you know what I was able to connect to my VPN with no problem so <laughs> I lost I guess uh, almost a day just you know try to figure out I thought it was something under wireless here uh, but it was not also uh, since I'm talking about this uh, I had a problem now if you have a problem uh, with your Wi-Fi uh, some of your devices or old devices like tablet is not able to see your you know your network at all uh, the chance is that right here 80211 band it was set in my case earlier it was set to 5 let me show you two value 5 gigahertz and as a result my um, uh, Android tablet on the Sun it could not see my Wi-Fi network and it just, you know, I was playing again, you know, I, I try to figure out what happened and then I called uh, every surfboard, uh, the vendor, and the guy told me, you know, change it to uh, 2.4. This is what I did because uh, some of the devices might not support 5 gigahertz, I guess, uh, frequency band. So if your tablet, your old tablets on Sun cannot see your Wi-Fi network, Therefore, you cannot connect even, you know, because it's not even listed out there. And I saw on the internet that a lot of people having problem uh, on the sun, you know, after they install a new modem uh, router and their devices uh, could not see the new network, uh, you know. So I guess go to your wireless configuration and uh, switch uh, from like 5 gigahertz to like 2.4. And that should solve most of the problems that you have. You know, I know I, I did a lot of research and I couldn't really see much uh, uh, resolutions out there. So, uh, of course, the, the best bet is to call your vendor, the modem vendor, uh, technical support, and walk you through it. They, they are pretty good in my case. You know, I call uh, Surfboard, every Surfboard, and they, I think they're owned by Motorola. And they they are able to, to help me out uh, fairly quick. So... I guess, you know, instead of get, getting frustrated, just call their technical support, okay? So hope this helps. And, you know, have any question, just post it below. And, uh, you know, um, you know, I'm new to this, so but at least, you know, maybe somebody else can um, comment on the solution. So, because I see a lot of problems with this, <laughs> believe me. <laughs> Alrighty, uh, we'll keep in touch. And, you know, uh, like I say, um, post any comments down there or you know you have problems let us know even though you're using different brands of you know um, routers somebody might be able to point you out and save you a lot of time and hassle alrighty thanks so much bye just to clarify on the firewall setting actually I set my uh, firewall protection to medium and that prevented me from connecting to my work VPN as I mentioned earlier 
Uh, however, you want some sort of uh, protection, but uh, in this case, you actually in this case, you can set it to low instead of off. Sorry about the shaky. Because you, you can have option of off, which is probably not good because, uh, you know, you want some sort of protection. So at least I put it in low. Again, if you know more about this, you can actually uh, play with other configurations to allow certain IP addresses and all of that, but I, I'm not going to go into it. So in this case, you can either set it to low, which is I recommend, so you have some protection, uh, or if you have to, you can set it to off, and that will allow your VPN uh, connection to go through. So, you know, so do not set it to premium or high unless you know how to uh, go around that, you know, uh, protection. So, alrighty, hope, hope it makes sense. Thank you.